What's up, dorks? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm accompanied by my Wait, dad. Cut, cut. You don't call them dorks. What's up, folks? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm accompanied by none other than my dad. He's actually new to the YouTube scene, so let us know in the comments if you'd like to see more of him or if you want to see him go on to his own channel. You never know. So today we will be unboxing his new Magic Keyboard for the iPad Pro 11-inch 2018 second generation. We'll, we have been anticipating it for like almost two months, and we ordered it just about a week ago. And let me tell you guys, we're hyped for it. This thing just barely came in from a surprise announcement that they were actually going to shorten the delivery time. So now that we actually have it, we can actually see why he preferred to choose this over other models or why he even carries the iPad in the first place. So uh, without further ado, uh, take it away, Dad. Thank you, son. Thank you for the introduction. I will take it from here. Um, as you can see, uh, I carry multiple devices on and EDC items. Uh, some of these uh, items include my uh, com computer for work, my computer for school, uh, my iPad for fun and business purposes as well. I also carry some of uh, my, my headphones and my earphones, a charger, mice, and my glasses, along with some manual note-taking items. Um, as you can see, it's a, it can be a hassle to carry all of these everyday uh, items um, because it gets heavy, you know, right? Um, I try to make it all fit in my bag, my computer work for, uh, bag for work. Uh, I want to say, um, along with that, I want to say that I've always been a fan, a big fan of I, uh, Apple products. Uh, going back to the early 2000s when they introduced some of the iPods and uh, they went through several generations. Uh, five pots and um, I even got the uh, the shuffle. I've lost uh, quite a few of them, but you can see I still carry some of those there. So um, uh, this, as of late, I've been becoming more of a fan as well. Um, I've I've purchased uh, several iPads. Um, you know the uh, the the pencil and and as of late, this is the um, new Magic Keyboard. Ooh, pretty excited about it. And. Um, since since you told me about the keyboard, uh, Walter, thank you by the way, uh, thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Um, I, I feel that the keyboard is going to combine a lot of the different functions from work, uh, from school, and some of the leisure things that I do, uh, including some of the manual note taking, uh, to the next level. So. So now that we have that out of the way, let's start with the unboxing so they can review this bad boy. All right, guys, so let's jump into the little unboxing. So if you guys can see, it's already an iPad key Magic Keyboard. It's the second generation type of Magic Keyboard from Apple. Uh, the one they had originally, it, uh, it's this one right here. I'll just show you guys real quick. See, nice, pretty thin. Doesn't have a trackpad, though. This one, however, does have a trackpad. So that's the perfect thing about this one. Not only does it have a trackpad, it also opens up and lifts up, kind of like a little hummingbird, kind of. You know what I'm saying? So uh, let's open this bad boy up, shall we? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Lucky for us, Apple actually introduces a little tape for right here. So we'll just go like this. Whoop. I'll never get it down right, though. Yeah. All right. All right. So now that we have that opened up, you can feel the box is pretty nice looking. All right. So let's uh, open this bad boy up real quick. Too bad that the hinges are just kind of weird back here. Ooh. Yummy, yummy. Look at that. Nice. Ooh, perfect the way it looks. So this is the 11 inch model. The 12 inch uh, doesn't have this big small of a screen. Whoa. Let's open this up. Ooh, that opened up nice and neat. Oh look, so the inside has its own little carrying stuff. Like the stickers and all that, we'll put that aside for now. However, this though, the main part, check that out dude. Oof, it's beautiful. Yeah, majestic, elegant. Ooh, look at that. All right, so I was looking at the keyboard right here. You can actually see that. Well, you can't see it right now, but you can see that the keyboards are going to be lit up. It actually has a backlit display. Look at that. And not only that, it has, comes with a little trackpad. Because the original one, as you can see right here, has no trackpad and it isn't backlit. So if you're laying in bed at night, Try to type up something you can't see the keyboard unless you really memorized it all right so now let's transfer over to actually putting it on 
So here is the 11 inch iPad Pro. As you can tell, this is the second generation, the 2018 version. The 2021 has this big camera right here, but it's still compatible and it still works. Boom, look at that. Let's see, let's add a little pencil. It'll be right. Fine. Look at that. Did you see that? It's all lit up and all that. No, it's not. Yeah, oh, it yeah. Is. It's kind of hard to tell with the lighting, but it's actually really lit up. You can actually tell. And it's looking nice. You can actually see the keyboard from far away. And if you look to the side over here, you can actually see that it has a USB-C. So not only do you have one for charging on the side, you actually have one for the bottom. So you can use it for charging down here, and then you can use this for another adapter. So you can plug in like a USB-C hub, and then you can do other things like transfer media, use a mouse if you really want to, if you don't like the trackpad. And what was also benefit from the last one is that now you can actually change the direction how you want to view it. So the viewing angle, you can go all the way like this, or you can go all the way back. That way if you're like sitting back on the bench or something and you actually want to see it, you can actually move it and boom. This whole thing is connected by magnets. So that's the interesting part. If there's no attachment on top or around the iPad, it's actually connected from the back. So if you just wanted to get up real quick and be like, oh, I don't, I don't need a keyboard right now. I just got to go, boom, good to go. And let's say, oh, I want it back on. And boom, it is good to go. Well, now that uh, we've had an opportunity to open up the product and play with it a little bit, I can truly say that the Mint Magic Keyboard, uh, along with the iPad, is going to cut down my EDC to one device and be able to execute um, approximately 80% of my daily activities, uh, meaning review work, email, uh, approving some work-related uh, activities, do my school work and uh, do logging into my classes, uh, read my ebooks, listen to my audiobooks, uh, watch a little bit of YouTube videos, and um, uh, along with some note taking. Um, thank God for good notes, am I right? Right. Eventually, I like to take a minimalist approach um, and make it a grab and go, especially when going from meeting to meeting and uh, while traveling. All right, guys, so in conclusion, that shows off pretty much the unboxing. As you can see, it was a keyboard for the iPad Pro second generation. Works for third generation as well. However, this one being a 2018 model second gen, uh, it fits snugly and actually works as intended. Uh, the backlight is a pretty interesting innovation for it. I think it's going to definitely help at night. Uh, the second charging point is definitely going to help out in the long run because you could charge and you could use something else at the same time. And overall, I just like the look of it, just flipping it forward and back. That's definitely going to help out my dad right here when he has to set it on a table and either lift it up to read more or set it back farther and lower it to read more, you know, get a better advantage at that. So anyways, uh, that was it. Uh, that's pretty 10 out of 10 unboxing. Uh, there's only one downside to that. You know what that is, Dad? Mm -mm. There's no stickers, dude. Oh.